going on family and day back again today we're going to take a look at the SH figure arts flash from the Justice League movie so um, yeah I know uh, some people are preferring uh, the Mayfax one but I think Mayfax is a little too expensive for one and their quality control is somewhat iffy sometimes I, I just like the sturdier feel figure arts and I will say uh, I did wish he would have came with at least another head, alternate head or something. But uh, I'll get in tap with his accessories because he doesn't come with much. But so let's uh, first go over some size comparisons. So bring this down and. Size comparison, so uh, standard Marvel Legends. Uh, another free art. Each, each go there. Uh, pretty well with your Mezco figures. DC Multiverse. It's smaller than that, so. <laughs> uh, do have articulated icons, so. Just one. See how that works, so. Um, let's bring in some other flashes that another DC Multiverse flash. From the TV series, 90s series. Uh, comic book version, multiverse. So, I mean, he does blow the uh, Mattel's movie version out of the water, so. Smaller than him, so. Uh. I'm uh, bringing these guys here real quick because my camera is starting to battery is going low. But I'm gonna bring in the two other ones I got so far, and I'll talk about this in a minute. Okay, back again. So, um, compare these three. Now, this Batman is kind of a smaller than I think he Ben Affleck still is taller than uh, Ezra. So. In terms of this, yeah, they didn't, they made him a little too short, but he should be compared to these figures, not to anybody else, so. Uh, I'm, I, I could be mistaken, though. To me, this looks, he doesn't look just a, a bit taller, I'm not sure. It, it may be looking that way on camera, but um, it looks like they're the same size, so I think they, Affleck should be a little bit taller than this Batman should be a little bit taller than Flash, but, you know, I'm just, like I said, I'm just going with Tree Yard, so it's, you know, so I'll be getting Superman and Superman one, so, it's, these three look pretty good together, so, I just wanted to talk about that, you know, everybody had a problem with that Batman, but, uh, I'm pretty coy, but only thing other nitpick besides him not coming with uh, an extra head, uh, no really kind of app crunch. I don't know what, what, what's going on in Bandai. They did with uh, Batman too. Uh, can't really do a not much of a uh, 
a good ab crunch. You know, usually you be able to do that more, especially with figure art. So I don't know why they're not doing that with the just these just League figures. So I mean, that's about as much as you can get, unless I'm doing something wrong. So, <laughs> but uh, I didn't see no extra moving parts. You know, where you can do get a deeper ab crunch or something. But you know, so. Uh, only other articulation I want to mention is these, uh, kind of this joint right there at the shoulder that pulls out. Because, I guess that once you get that little funky run, I don't know why they, it, it, <laughs> they had them running like that. It's kind of funny, but you can mainly get that run that Ezra does, the way he swings his shoulders when he's running. So, that's nice that they got that on there. I think the face scope looks like him. You know, well, I think I think those lips are a little bit focused. There, a little bit. Uh, looks like he got in 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 person. Looks like he's got some lipstick on, but I still think it looks like him. So now, in terms of accessories, like I said, he doesn't. He only comes with uh three pairs of hands. So the fist hands. Your chop hands. And then just another open palm hands. Cause you want just your hands or, or the crazy running pose hands. So that's really what it comes with. Is just uh, another three sets of hands. So, you know, um, maybe some lightning effects but I'm that I'm not worried about that another set another head would have been nice if to come with this guy but you know for the pro I only paid forty three dollars so I'm happy about that and so I mean the effects I can get the effects anywhere but you know I wish he did come with another pair another head another head so but that's all I can really say though so um it's I, I guess it's up to you I think if you're price wise he's better to, he's uh, cheaper to get and he's not a bad figure he's not bad it's just those things uh, I don't know why, why uh, Bandai is not doing better with the ab crunch with Justice League figures I don't know and uh, just wish you with another head that's all but I don't know if you if you're not even into this, it's an easy pass. It's just up to you. If you want to spend more money and get the Mayfax one, that's up to you. So, but uh, this has just been my look at this figure. After the so, uh, thanks guys for watching. Stay tuned for more reviews. Uh, hit the like and subscribe and share and all that. And until next time, don't support scalpers. Peace. I'm gonna have to insert this. Um, I forgot to talk about the unique way how his head uh able to get his head to look up because there's uh the rib is there. You gotta kind of like uh push it back so you can get him to look up. Uh, you can make him look up pretty far once you get that over that ribbit back there. So you see that, and this is how it goes back up. So. Insert.